Hello guys, welcome! Thank you for stopping by, thank you for watching my channel Ivana Tero. This is weekly general and love tarot reading for zodiac sign Sag for men and for women born under this sign. December 10th until December 16th 2018 is in front of us. So let's try to see together my dear friends what you can expect. Let me start with your job business work department okay so what we have in here wow <laughs> discontent and boredom <laughs> oh my dear sagittarians is this is really how you feel hmm? tell me put your comments on my channel do you really feel that you are disconnected from reality disconnected from your colleagues disconnected from your current job that you are doing is this really what is happening now now with jupiter in your sign guys don't you worry about your next step because jupiter your ruler he will help you to expand business job product product or whatever you are doing now any kind of job and you ain't gonna feel boredom no more so basically this tarot card is saying maybe you already have a plan what to do with your life what to do with your job you know so the distance is calling you you can see a man on a balcony or in a porch you know whatever you know and you know in a distance you know we can see a church but also could be a castle this is like part of the sky heaven something like a distance you know which is your thing you know and we can see nature so obviously you know long distance of any kind like you know new adventure is calling your name maybe this very second maybe you really think that you are disconnected that everybody have a life just but you know maybe if you feel really this uh, boredom then honey what can i say do something you know change something i mean either you do change something or either you just decide you know to wait i know that probably jupiter will help you to realize you know why you are disconnect this content and disconnected and discontent you know in in your life you now and jupiter will, will bring a new quality of your life especially when it comes to uh, your job okay so the next tarot card is major arcana the fool hmm what is this all about what this tarot card is doing in a work department so i think you know you have a new project on your mind uh and you are daring you know but be careful there is a cliff you know so be careful guys you know what you're doing you know with your life um i mean taking a risk more or less is always a good thing always you know because you know the biggest risk is not taking risk you know at all uh so uh, this is you climbing on a social hierarchy level. This is you experimenting with something. So simple, this tarot card is saying follow your instinct. Nothing is wrong, you know, with it. But also try, uh, you know, not only to be playful, you know, because while uh, Saturn is in Sun Capricorn, this Saturn always is saying, you know, okay, okay, try something new. But never do anything and to put yourself in the jeopardize of any kind this is basically major kind of the fool okay so the next tarot card uh, while i'm talking about your work department is nine of swords so this is you rushing rushing you're very hasty you have an idea on your mind you will organize you know somebody or group of people so nothing is boring in your life or if you feel boredom Believe me, this boredom ain't gonna stay for quite long in your life. So Knight of Swords simply is saying that maybe this is you planning a trip, shifting something, changing the way how you talk, walk, how you react, maybe changing uh, people in your surrounding. So, you know, Knight of Swords is rather good, you know, tarot card, very hasty, very action-oriented. So I do not think that you have this boredom of any kind because I can see you on the run on the run okay ten of wands okay ain't gonna be easy guys ain't gonna be easy 
This tarot card basically is saying the, the, the most powerful message is do you believe in you? And by the way, while for the next year Jupiter is in your sign, this Jupiter is asking you, do you believe in you? How much you believe in you, you know? So uh, free your spirit, free your mind, you know, uh, be action oriented, but pay attention and gonna be easy, you know? But nothing is easy, okay? So probably gathering, planning your structure and very hasty, basically starting with something new. This is excellent, guys. This is not boring uh, week at all. Now let me say something about love department for Sages. Okay, give me guys like two, three, four seconds. I need to reshuffle my cards and then I will explain everything what I can see. Okay, so let me start with the first arrow card which is wisdom. Okay, okay, so you are wise you want to learn this is you probably still learning about relationship um i don't know maybe this is your job you know maybe maybe you need uh, to deal with other people maybe this is other people asking you for wise advice and uh, i think that someone appreciates you more than basically you know because you can see guys you know you can see beautiful little dog you can see a man who will look like a priest with his cloak and with a Bible or any kind of other book and you can see these people so these people have expectations from you or could be vice versa but I think that those people have some expectations this could be a current partner having like you know big expectations uh, you know big expectations so you need to be wise you need to think and a lot you know how you will handle this situation probably inside of your house so wisdom is required the very next tarot card is ten of pentacles okay this is about money uh, ten of pentacles this is about once again wisdom knowledge wealth this is accumulating of some uh, 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 this is this is big money I don't know how this is related mm, maybe you will invite someone maybe this is your colleague maybe this is your business client maybe someone will invite you uh, 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 this is you mm, okay give me a couple of seconds uh, <laughs> who knows maybe you will meet someone who is rich Maybe this is your money. Maybe you think how much money you are willing um, to invest in uh, this love relationship. But also this could be mm, 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 this could be reevaluating re uh, what your next step is going to be. Is it worth to invest such a big money uh, in this person? Okay. The next tarot card is King of Pentacles. Guys, you are dealing with Virgo, Capricorn or Taurus or at least some of you. So this person is good because this is very stable. Money and uh, wisdom, uh, good communication, making, you know, plans. So, okay, this is not bad. And for so many of you, this is someone that you know. This could be your ex-colleague, this could be your current calling colleague this could be your business client as well so king of pentacles is the most impressive tarot card for love reading because this is family man this is a provider this is a man who think ahead about you know planning future and planning future slowly but steady wow what is this three of swords wow 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 this could be your ex, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, who wants to come back. Huh. Okay, let me see. Hmm. Now you need to be wise. You can lose money because of this person. Probably this is your ex. Probably. Uh, <laughs> careful. Please be very careful with this person. Because if this is if this person um, destroyed you and your finances like once, then don't do that. Because this is a danger. 
on the horizon. Three of swords. Be careful. Be careful. Maybe for some of you, this is the sign of separation. Maybe you are afraid that you will lose a great deal of money if you uh, proceed with getting a divorce. Guys, this could be it. I mean, for some of you, at least. And the final tarot card is Nine of Wands. Okay, Leo Sage or Aries. This could be you, but also this could be Leo Sage Aries, who uh, you already know. This is obviously someone who is coming from the past. Maybe this is like your old acquaintance. Maybe even this is your ex, you know. Uh, I don't know. Doesn't have to be, but this is not completely new person. This is someone at least that you know. And this person probably will uh, be very, uh, you know, enthusiastic about starting a relationship with you. Knight of Wands. Knight of Wands. This is, guys, uh, lust. This is passion. This is impulse, uh, sex impulse. And if you can't have this man, probably you will be uh, frustrated. Uh, when this man appear in your life, act fast, be bold, and believe in success. Okay? Okay. So, this is your weekly reading. Guys, book a private reading with me if you want. It's easy. Uh, even a tarot at hotmail.com uh, Make sure to subscribe on my channel. And please, guys, like and share this video with your friends. God bless you all. Bye.